Hey guys, welcome back. This is going to be a little bit different of an episode. It's more going to be one focused, but uh, not really focused on anything. It's just Vlad and I playing Stellaris, hanging out. It's going to be a great one to play in the background while you're doing something else. It's not intense gameplay happening every second. Not really a lot of me or Kansas or Vlad, I'm sorry, talking to the camera. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Please let me know in the comments what you think about videos like this. Much longer, more passive listening I guess but enjoy the video all right now he offered me white piece that's nice I guess even though technically the game thinks he's superior oh, to me I think I'm about to encounter you by the way here's hoping or not that works too Ah, food problem. What? <laughs> My food is being difficult. Hmm. I'm sitting here trying to slap a band-aid on it as fast as I can. <laughs> Do what you can, man. Plasma throwers. Nice. Two hundred and ninety six influent peasants peasant change. <laughs> yeah, that's the spirit. Alright, so what's my plan of action now? 
You got a lot of stuff. I feel like you need to go first. When I say you, I don't mean you, obviously. I mean the guy that I'm looking at on my screen. I figured. I'm surprised okay. we haven't met each other. I'm trying. Eventually, my borders are just going to push across this thing and get to you. Yeah. My explorers should trip across you pretty soon here. Yeah? Yeah, they've, they've bridged the gap. Okay. That's right, I can declare rivals and get more unity. Yep. Forgot about that. It is useful at times. Why are they superior now? I don't get this. I don't get how these AI just suddenly surpass me. Hey, 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 hey! You motherfucker. These blue motherfuckers started a fucking military outpost in the middle of my space. Excuse me? I will fucking break you. They probably want you to try. That moment when I'm just spewing resources at everything in sight. Hey, hey, you just closed their borders to me. Is Probably me. Uh, no, I don't think so. Nope, nope, it's not him. I don't see you yet. Must be these guys. Yeah, they closed their borders to me. Fuck your couch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's because I started this single fucking... Uh, colony right on the edge of their space. <laughs> oops. I guess. I was gonna say, is that really oops? No. I just like to pretend I'm a nice guy. Never hurts, right? Oh no, it hurts. Don't you worry. I it suppose. Hurts sometimes. Maybe you. I swear to god, this guy's fucking military outpost in the middle of my space is just really frustrating it was on one system that was just barely outside of my borders There we go. That should do it. That'll do, pig. That'll do. That'll do.
I think I found you. These guys are aggressive. It did. Says the uh, cannibalistic hive mind. No, like they'll put a. Uh, they just put a. Um, what should I call it? A frontier or a frontier outpost in the one system that was just barely outside my borders. Yeah, that's what happened like, to me. Wow, they're they're aggressive. Motherfuckers. That's what they are. Yeah. I'm gonna shove back with a fucking thorny ass boot. Declare war on these guys again yet? Twenty-two forty-five. I got a while yet. I don't know why these guys are like superior to me. Alright, four colonies developing at the same time definitely hurts your energy credits. It's not great. It's not great. <laughs> what do I need for the next one? 1876. Wow. Alright. That's, that's a while. Hell yes. What? Got an ascension perk. Oh, nice. I'm quite a few days away from that. Tiny people. That's what I'm trying to do. Increase my border range, so I'm just pinching him back out of the space he took over. Come on. Let me guess. One of your systems is named Popma. Nope. Oh? Oh, wait. Yeah. Yeah. So I've definitely found you. I just have to research you. Which, oh, okay. let's be honest, I'm being a little lazy right now. You too? I haven't researched anyone. Yeah. My borders should definitely be pushing up on yours, though. Oh, yeah. I can see the, the pressure from some of your stuff. Because they are reaching... They're just like a speck away from the other side. That's okay. Warp Drive 2! The Fifth Empire does not care.
I think I've built up everything I can in my like my home systems. Like as far as outposts go or mining structures and research facilities. Yeah, I'm getting there for sure. I think you have a lot more territory than I do. I have a neutral fleet of moo aliens in my system. I'm not a fan of it. <laughs> I wouldn't be either. Oh, they're the space cows. Never mind. Oh, space cows. No problem at all. Yeah. Man, a planet with high gravity and a weak magnetic field. Here, let me build on it. We sense prey. Oh, did you find me? Not you. Okay. I just love how that's my response. <laughs> to everything. Yeah. Hi, right, we'd like to give you a gift. I sense prey. Ooh-wee, I smell dinner, boys. <laughs> That's what your guy sounds like in my mind. Yeah. When in all reality, not exactly something to be trifled with. <laughs> More than likely, anyways. No. no. You're probably definitely not something I'd like to fuck with, but at the same time, I've got a couple of aces up my sleeve. So I'll deal with it when I get there. If you even have to. If I even have to. Species that I've never met and happen to be talking to over voice communications. Yep. That's me. It's me. The cannibal. I mean, what? Well, that is me. Well, not really. You probably don't eat your own race. Here's hoping. You're just like the fucking spider race out of the one book that I, I've been reading lately. Hmm? Hmm? Just like, what do they do? They consume everything. Oh, lovely. You motherfucker. He started another goddamn... Ooh. He started another fucking outpost in my territory. I will break you. Puny man. Actually, you might have a larger military than me. Maybe I won't break you. Yeah, I'm not going to break you. <laughs> I'm going to leave you alone like the gentle giant you are. Is that what he is? For now. <laughs> I'm running out of money, so that's going to have to change here. I am not. What's your mineral output at? 121. Plus 560. See, I don't understand how that's even possible. If you're limited to the amount of space that I think you are, that's probably what's doing it. Yeah, maybe. Because if you're limited to the amount of space I'm looking at, 
you're not going to get a lot in that area. Meanwhile, I've coded the upper part of my map. Oh boy, my border is just probably pushed on yours pretty strongly. Nah. I still have to get rid of this angry couple. Oh, well, my two neighbors just went into a defensive pact. I was about to say, I, I just saw that and I'm like, you know, they're, they're surrounding him. Hmm. He probably doesn't approve of that. Not even in the slightest. Guess it's time to expand elsewhere, because it looks like the lower ring doesn't have anybody. Oh, I'm almost done feed getting warp drive too. Ugh. Almost there. You can just taste it. Oh, hi there. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, God. I've got to get better at dealing with this influence. I need to start putting out some edicts. Mm-hmm. That's good. Get me some motherfucking science. Yeah, I've had an engineering edict since the very start. This star is within someone else's borders. Someone else can fuck off. Might be mine. It is. Yeah, not much I can really do about that. No, I'm not worried about it. Ugh. Bitch, you ugly. I ain't pretty. No, another race I met. They are fugly as fuck, and they immediately shut their borders to me. That's right, get fucked. Oh, they're large. They're quite large. Oh, yeah? Yeah, their race is pretty impressively grown. Hmm. What's their name? Uh, the Jabanid Hierarchy. Oh, okay. I mean, they're not quite as large as the glorious Fifth Empire. Looks like yours is just like really elongated. It's kind of, yeah, it's what I do. Don't judge. Not judging. Okay. Never judge. Holy shit, can we get some energy, please? Bye. Still have yet to meet you. There we go, finally, I just researched you. Oh, hi. 
the empire of the cuddle pricks. Yeah. Cooperation will certainly benefit us. <laughs> my border is just immediately closed. Well, my Fuck basic you. stance is, uh, my stance is immediately closed borders. With zero diplomacy. Well, that's what that's I said cool, it to. That's a cool little symbol you got, though. Yeah, it's the same as somebody else's, though, now that I see. It's pretty, it's pretty neat, though. It's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, they really have expanded pretty well. The uh, Jehabadnid hierarchy. Yeah. They're sizable. I'm gonna leave them alone for the most part. How come you always get stuck building tall? I don't know. I don't know what it is. Maybe I'm just. a magical power for it. Maybe I'm just too slow on the expansion. Okay, yeah, you're right. You're blocking exactly two systems on this side. And that's it. Yeah. I am aggressively bullying the guy to myself, though. <laughs> that's okay. I'm all right with all of this, because I'm just going to prop back and like start popping my galactic popcorn. Yep. <laughs> what you do watch some motherfuckers fry from over here from over here clear across the milky way See these shitty dots of this blue guy's space, though, that are in the middle of my space? Yeah, I saw that. Fuck this guy. <laughs> Asshole. You are an asshole. Not every alien empire is establishing communications with me, and it can kind of fuck off. Yeah, I'm in the same spot. On the bright side, you don't really have to deal with it, because your empire is just like, yeah, yeah, well, fuck your couch. I mean, I still have to see it. Yeah. Like, it still pops up, unfortunately. <laughs> that is a shame. It'd be great if your door slammed itself in their face. It really would be, honestly. Let's just save each other the trouble here, guys. It's like, hi, welcome to my house, and here's the way out. Goodbye. Oh, what the See fuck is this later, motherfucker nerd. doing? You cr you're encroaching on my space. I don't like you. Brown motherfucker. Wow. <laughs> so that his, was his just sad. <laughs> His empire's color is brown. I just, just wow there. <laughs> just wow. I really need to get this uh, energy crisis under control here. It's really not doing good for the uh, the genes.
Unemployment? Excuse me? You're not allowed to be poor in my empire. This is Trump's fifth empire. Oh. Making Stellaris great again. Somebody closed their borders to me? I'm shocked. Truly shocked. <sighs> Gasp. <laughs> oh man, I've looked at another alien race known as the Chi aliens. Neat. Excuse me while I ignore time. them for a little while. Unrest. All right. Not cool. Not a good time. All right, what's your problem, big guys? Right, crayon eating motherfuckers. What do you got a problem with? Unhappy pops. Purged pop resource output. What? what? Really need this to hurry up there, guy. Their happiness is just low as fuck. They're solitary, which sucks. Planet habitability is a little low. And then faction happiness is only 30%. <sighs> uh. <laughs> you have factions. Synth Envy, fuck right off. It's not a problem here. Wait, where did I suddenly get credits from? Okay, not questioning it. <laughs> Everybody's getting into pacts around me. It's enough to make a guy go mad. A dog chasing cars. I wouldn't want to know what I'd do if I caught one. That's pretty much where we're at, in all honesty. Holy shit, I've played so many goddamn games lately that I just keep clicking the wrong keys. <laughs> you too, huh? Ugh, I keep left-clicking to move, and that's definitely not how you move. Keep seeing my energy's low and wondering where my cap booster is. What, not funny? Alright, I'll try a different joke next time. No, sorry, I'm not paying attention right now. I'm reading the traditions. Ah, looking for your next one? Yeah. Kleptocracy seems like a cool one for you. I'm looking at anguish. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah. Or maybe I should go for, like, uh, industry. It's coming up quick, too. I should figure that out.
Because these Can bottom I quit ones, we like everyone and his brother. These bottom ones, we only get like one or two of them, don't we? Like, I feel like there were ones that like canceled each other out. Kinda. Like, if you go the technology route, you really don't get the option of doing like the the gene therapy route. Okay. Oh, yep, and there went the remainder of my growth. Rip that idea. What happened? I run into a bumper. Oh. So we're just going to go ahead and throw four colony ships on the cooker and go ahead and expand to whatever I can within my borders. Because that is how I do. Unlocked well, solar panel networks. Woo. There is a mod out there that makes it so that you can uh, make all your power plants 7-Eleven stations instead. And every pop that gets put on it looks like an Indian guy. <laughs> wow, that's incredibly <laughs> racist. <laughs> you think I care? No. Just pointing it out. Vlad don't give a fuck. Vlad got feelings to hurt everywhere. Doing anguish. Core sector systems plus one. Please no. I cannot manage this much of a shit fest. Sure you can. I mean, I can. The question is, do I want to? And the answer to that one is also no. Seriously, I don't care. Where's the shut up mod when I need it? Oh man, somebody just requested me to be their protector. Do they know what that means? <laughs> So that means sure, that we'll, pro we'll protect you in our belly. That's literally what that would mean. Remember, we get happiness from eating Xenopops. Ugh. I feel like I've definitely gotten more than 14 count. Or people saying hi to me. Alright, time to see if the sector stuff works. I mean, thus far, it seems to have been doing a pretty solid job. Okay. Like, the AI aggression you're noticing, I'm thinking that's probably part of the AI. They know, they realized they could build there, and so they're just like, fuck yeah. I'll take it. Oh god, energy credits, alright. Those four colony ships that I started, it got a bit aggressive. Oh man, so that's, oh, that's running with OBS, that's right. 
You're not gonna believe what just happened. What? Bet you five bucks I just got a new YouTube subscriber. Yep, that happened. Huh. The audio played for when I'm streaming and I get a new subscriber. Huh. And I was like, oh man, there's loud music. Literally jumped. Like, no offense to you, but how the fuck are you getting subscribers? Uh, that... I subscribe to you because I'm your friend, but... E-videos, man, they're working out. I guess. Oh, and I'm... buildable pop robots, thank you god. And I don't think you understand just how much work I'm doing besides just recording and editing. Oh, fucking shitty-ass synth and be Fuck this. Eh, uh, our dicks are small, because somebody else has robots before us. Eh. Uh. Fucking hate that pop. Yeah. Alright, this is gonna hurt in a second here. When I mobilize my military. What, it's gonna hurt your frame rate, or what? Uh, hurt my resources. Ah. Yeah, you'll get that. Sure, I'll go with a planetary shield generator. That sounds neat. Well, there's a lot of stuff going on right now, politically speaking, that my race just really doesn't care about. Make all the friends you want. It won't save you in the end. Like, holy shit, the entire upper part of my border, my fucking game is just overflowing yeah wow holy crap well, god damn it settle into a goddamn pact or some shit no don't do that then it really will be impossible <laughs> Vlad does not mind difficulty adversity built character Except for when adversity make game last five years. Adversity built character with fist through screen. Oh god damn, finally ran myself out of minerals. That took a moment. Ooh, yeah, I was sitting at like 7,000. Excuse me? That's a thing? Hello? Can I dick around with that? That sounds awesome. I want to modify my robot. <laughs> Could you not? Anomaly found. Yes, I get it. There's a lot of space and it has things and stuff. Please. Okay, I can finally fix the synth and be thank fucking Christ. There. He's happy now. The densest motherfucker. I 
I can't build level six stations yet. Once I got cruisers, I kind of chilled out. Yeah, I'm upgrading all of my space stations right now. To get my military capacity way up. I also put solar panels on every single one. Quality. Oop, yeah, that hurt. Well, that actually doesn't hurt as bad as I thought it would. I thought it would have hurt my energy a lot more than it did. Oh, you declared war on those guys. I'd be very interested in mopping up what happens next. Ooh planet of the titans that sounds like a bad time except it's not it's actually a really good time because it gives me those titanic armies oh yeah that's right forgot about those all right what military am i gonna squash in here oh that's actually two really strong forces there's two 2.7k fleets in this system. And they're just ambient ones. Okay, get literally torn apart. Forgot with my ascension or my uh, tradition. Every time I research something that increases naval capacity, it reduces naval upkeep by four percent. Oh. So uh, I need to be researching all of them. Yeah, that'll do it. Seven K against uh four eighty eight. Don't mind if I do. Jesus. I quite like stomping them into the ground. Well. I was hoping to have a seal club event tonight. But you should have thought of that before you became peasants. Exactly. There's so much, like, diplomacy going on that I can't even handle it. Holy crap, that is a large empire. The block of Daggerfawn, Jessenax Union, those are all very large areas. No, you can't be. I can't see what you're seeing, obviously. I've got a pretty big chunk myself. Yeah, they just look girthier i guess but this uh this job and hierarchy they are overwhelming to me they might be the fallen empire it, it just says they're independent no they're they're not the fallen they're just assholes i don't really yeah, assholes. i don't see the fallen empire on here anywhere did we put them on uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I put on one Fallen Empire. 
Just remember that they're not exactly the most communicative sorts. Well, not always. Remember, we had that one that was, like, super nice. Yeah. Rare and far between. Every single sleeper race that I ever seem to come across is always, like, a bunch of fucking dickheads. I think it also helped that I was a super friendly race in that one. Yeah, you're not. You're not in this one. Nope. You're what I would define as being the opposite. Fair enough. Alright, this managing everything with just my home systems is getting frustrating. More, More sectors. sectors. What's my sector doing anyways? You tricky pickle. Something like that, sure. Oh, we're at max influence now. Man, there really was just fuck all going on in my corner of the galaxy. It was really nice somehow. Yeah.
And there's a lot of building stuff going on over here. I don't know about you. Oh, don't you worry. I'm I'm definitely lots of building over here. Yep, work, work. <laughs> Much work. Many dues. How are you? Okay, whatever, man. How am I what? Not you. Oh, I want to be recognized for something, please. How are you inferior to me? Me? You're inferior in fleet power and naval capacity. Yeah, take a look at the technology, though. Superior. It just doesn't make sense. I mean, it does. If you could see what I was doing over here, it does. Because, like, the guys next to me are overwhelming. But your race is just listed as inferior. Oh, also, I'm just going to go nip that one in the bud real quick. Oh? Yeah, you'll see. Just going to build up a huge military? No. Something else. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Rip cool. brown guys. What the they just fuck? get annihilated? Yeah, they're gone. Interesting. They, they legit no longer exist. Oh. How wonderful. God, I am border shoving this poor motherfucker hard. Which one, the little blue guy? Yeah. Yeah, he's not doing so good either. The tiny blue guy next to me? He yeah. went to war with other people and got himself taken over. He used to be the brown guy. Okay. Uh, maybe that's the one up there. Oh, that one. Okay, yeah. Galactic hegemony? Why are you... I feel like you're down here. No? Where are you? I guess you're the only one left. Why is this guy insulting me? Alright, go ahead and insult me behind your, like, uh... All your defensive packs and what, where I'm over here being independent. Living at large. Yeah, this guy just gave me, like, insulted me, and he's small and pretty much insignificant compared to me, but he's got defensive packs and guaranteed independence. I would like to point out the fact that my first Empress has not died. Um, my Empress is immortal. Oh. Well, so, then. uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Checkmate, motherfucker. <laughs> you have played your cards right, sir. 
Yeah, that's the nice thing about uh, Hive Mind is your leader is immortal. Got me good. <laughs>